Hey guys, here's Lampman92, and today I'm trying to use the 59th minute technique and show to you that it actually works. So I'm searching for gold players, obviously. Then uh, I would pick a formation like 41212 or 442, which is often used when players are bought more in this formation. And then I chose a buy now price maximum of 2000 coins just to have less players and then uh, we proceed a bit faster because it uh, lasts quite a long time I think I'll go up to page 80 or so um, another advice is really proceed to the 59th minute because I may have lost some bargains because I uh, went through these sites and there were players that might have been cheap and didn't buy them but it uh, just takes so much time just to click through every page and I would really um, yeah, recommend to uh, go straight forward to the 59th minute and here we almost are uh, Ivanovich fit to high price here next page Oh, there, right there, 84 rated Gomez for 1,500 coins. I bought him. Into the trade pile. Go on further. Next page. There's an agar, 850 coins. Buy him. And the trade pile. And then a, uh, uh, too high price. Page Agar 1500 too high the price. No, no one there. And you click through the pages and you have to wait a little bit of time. I prefer to um, do this technique in the evening when there are a lot more players online and uh, so there are a lot more players offered on the trade market. And there are often newer um, players coming up because they set them for um, one hour sale. And Linus, Nico Lean 900 coins, I buy him even though he's not in the good um, position. Alexander, Decker. Was kind of a Juru, it was the other version of him I bought in, but this version is too high the price. I have a low 1600 coins, buy him now. So I bought four players, and I, at the beginning I think I had 6000 coins, more or less. And now I spend, yeah, um, 5000 coins. And I'll just um, put them up for any higher price. I should have probably looked it up before, but for the purposes of the video, I'll just um, you know, choose some prices I think might be accurate for these players. 2800 for Abelora. And Agar. Yeah. 1,500 and uh, 2,000. Maybe a bit high, but I hope he'll sell. And then we'll make a cut here, and I come back when hopefully the players are sold. All right, guys, I'm back. Let's see if I sold the players successfully. Uh, so let's go to the trade pile. Oh yeah, three or four. So Gomez, which is on 500, Nikoli for the buy now price of 1,600, Nabalo for the buy now price. Agar was probably a bit too high, so I set him lower to a buy now price of 1,800 coins. But this was quite good actually. Now I've got 
7,700 coins around. And I already made a win and didn't even sell the last player. And now we wait again. Yeah guys, I'm back and let's look at, oh, I sold Aga for 1,500 coins. I set him on the trade pile another time because 1,800 was too high, maybe. And now I've got 9,100 coins and made an actual win of around 3,000 coins just with these four players. So the 59th minute technique actually works if you look longer then you might even find better bargains than I did now. But it really works and that was what I wanted to prove. Okay guys, see you later. So here are my 7 tips for you. First tip, buy players in the evening. As I said, um, there are more players on the market. Buy only gold players because you know the price is for them easier and most people buy gold players. Third, choose a formation. For example, 41212, which is bought more often because a lot of people use this formation for their ultimate team. Fourth tip, set a maximum buy now price of like 2000 coins just as I did um, because you know these prices and there are not that much players on the list because if you don't try, uh, set a maximum then uh, you have to click for ages until you are at the last page. Fifth tip, proceed actually to the 59th minute as I explained you might lose some bargain but you are better off in the end. Sixth tip, Know the prices. Uh, it's often that you have to um, know about actual yeah, news on Ultimate Team. For example, uh, when the Inform Cam Yeso card came out, its price fell like from uh, 6,000 coins in the 41212 formation to yeah, an average price of 2,000 coins, and you have to know that uh, because if you don't know that, you cannot make the bargains. Seventh tip, buy quickly. If you have uh, seen and recognized the player for uh, only few coins, because there are a lot of people who do this technique, especially in the evenings. So if you uh, yeah, waste your time on looking for other players and hoping, oh, hopefully he will be on the trade pile when I'm back, it doesn't work, buy him quickly. So if this video gets uh, 20 likes or more, then I'll start a new series this weekend. Um, maybe sound weird that I only yeah, did this uh, when I reach 20 likes. It's not that much, but I'm very new to YouTube and that would be really great for me. Also, I would like to read your comments on this video and subscribe if you want to my channel Lampen92. Check it out for more videos uh, about FIFA 11, especially Ultimate Team. So see you guys.